The biggest story this week is the Suez Canal. Now, for those of you going, Suez Canal? What happened at the Suez Canal? What's the Suez Canal? Then I'm comfortable saying you don't watch the news. Here's what happened. A skyscraper-sized ship called the Ever Given veered sideways while traversing the Suez Canal. It got stuck and clogged a major trade artery for six days. It was estimated that the world lost 9.6 billion US dollars in trade volume for every day the ship was stuck. Now, some of you might be wondering what a ship stuck in Egypt has to do with Taiwan, and I'll tell you. It's Japanese-owned, Taiwanese-operated, registered in Panama, and piloted by an Indian crew. I feel bad for the lawyer who needs to figure out who's responsible. You probably already know that the ship is no longer stuck. My source, is the ship still stuck.com, says the Ever Given was stuck for 6 days, 3 hours, and 38 minutes, costing about 59 billion US dollars in trade. Now, losing 59 billion of anything is no laughing matter. But when it comes to setups for jokes, this may be the best one ever given. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll be here all week, don't forget to tip your waiters. NPR reporter Camilla Dominowski tweeted, asking for stupid ideas to solve the problem. For example, she proposed getting many helicopters to lift one end of the boat. Others jumped in with impractical ideas, like shoving a giant cotton swab up the canal, using industrial grade lubricant, or putting a ramp over the Ever Given to let other ships jump over it. Then pop culture came to the rescue with people taking ideas from Disney, Godzilla, and cartoons to solve the problem. Other internet users, however, took comfort in the fact that they weren't the ones that clogged the canal. The Higgs boat Swain tweeted, Good news for today. Whatever happens, at least you're not the guy who got his boat stuck in the Suez Canal and broke maritime shipping. And another meme says, you may make mistakes, but at least they're usually not we can see your mistake from space bad. But the strangest part about this whole ordeal is how much people related to a ship stuck in a canal. A bunch of images of builders trying to dislodge the ever given surfaced, and people began using those images as metaphors to comment on their own work ethic and well-being. For example, here the giant ship is labeled the incessant crushing weight of existence. Next to it is a tiny tractor labeled drinking exactly two beers. You might think that people were relieved when the ship started moving again, but no, actually people were sad to see it go. New memes are constantly surfacing. The last three weeks have been really eventful, but for those who need a refresher, have a look at this meme. It says, Taiwan in 1971. We left the UN and are very sad. However, Taiwan in 2021 is more like we have TSMC and yummy pineapples. Love salmon and block the Suez Canal. What a difference 30 years makes. Can you imagine where Taiwan will be in the next 30 years? We're going to be blocking off space canals, tell you what. All the way up in outer space, disrupting intergalactic trade.